Oh, shit. It's the Breakfast Club, bitches. Who's donkey of the day today? <laughs> Donkey of the day for Wednesday, July 22nd goes to a 29-year-old woman in Louisiana named Jenna Lisa Lawrence. Now, Jenna Lisa Lawrence is wanted for attempted second-degree murder. Her bond is $150,000, and police believe she fled from Louisiana to Dallas because that's where she's from. Or that, that's what they thought. She's actually turned herself in since then. Uh, second-degree murder. Well, what did this young queen do to catch that charge? Well, Jenna Lisa is what I like to call a peace disruptor. A agitator of auras, the type that cannot allow a spirit to just be still. Oh, yes, we all have those kinds of people in our lives. Do you understand at 42 years old, all I want to do is protect my peace by any means necessary? My mental health diet is very important. If what I'm taking in does not nourish my mental health, I don't allow it in my space. My peace is non-negotiable. I'm not going anywhere I don't want to be. I'm not doing anything I don't want to do, and I'm damn sure not going to talk or be around anyone I don't want to be with. See, some people, like Jenna Lisa, just want to argue. I know the type. They enter your space and can't wait to get into a back and forth with you. Now, I love me a good debate, okay? That, but sometimes, you know what I'm saying? I don't. And that's why sometimes when people text you certain things, looking for a debate, an argument, a back and forth, whatever you want to call it, if I don't ignore it completely, I just reply back, Okay, that's growth. But see, that's not enough for a peace disruptor like Jenna Lisa. No, no, no. People like that will not stop until you go back and forth with them. And as a wise man named Little Duval once told us, I'm living my best life, ain't going back and forth with you. Ain't going back and forth with you. No. That ain't going back and forth part is very important. But once again, an agitator of auras like Jenna Lisa, she not having it. She won't stop until she transfers that negative energy that exists within her into you. That's the law of energy, kids. Sir Isaac Newton said it best. The law of energy is energy is never lost or destroyed, just merely transferred from one party to the next. And that's exactly what Jenna Lisa was trying to do. See, according to Action News 2 in Atlanta, Jenna Lisa was upset because her boyfriend refused to argue with her. Did you hear me? Jenna Lisa was upset because her boyfriend refused to argue with her. Jenna Lisa, do you know how many women would love to have a man who doesn't argue with them? Do you know how many women would love to have a man who didn't pick a fight about every little thing? It's some women driving to work right now, listening to Donkey of the Day, angry. Because their man picked a fight with them last night or first thing this morning. They was up arguing about something stupid. I promise you this quarantine has tested the strength of so many relationships, has tested the patience in so many relationships. And so many people have sat around and asked themselves repeatedly, what are we arguing about now? Because they have a significant other who absolutely positively always has to find something to argue about. Meanwhile, Jenna Lisa, you have a man who doesn't want to argue with you. He's probably chanting to himself spiritually disciplined brother who's trying to be the best version of himself okay attempting to have heightened energy and more sensitivity towards others nice compassionate buddha chant just listen <laughs> yes just, just protecting his space, okay? Protecting his truth, protecting his peace. And then, pow! This happens. Let's go to KSA, KSLA News 12 for the report, please. A man is fighting for his life tonight, and the woman police believe is responsible is 29-year-old Gina Alicia Lawrence. She is allegedly the estranged girlfriend of a 34-year-old man that was shot. Lawrence allegedly shot him following a dispute. She left the area in a green Honda Accord with primer on the left passenger side front door. Right now, police have a warrant charging Lawrence with attempted second-degree murder. That's right. Uh, Gina Lisa shot her boyfriend simply because her boyfriend didn't want to argue with her. You see how negativity works? Do you see how negative energy works? Jenna Lisa's boyfriend didn't do anything to her. She wasn't mad at him. She was mad at herself. Whatever hurt she had inside of her, she passed on to him because that's what hurt people do. Hurt people. Healed people, heal people, hurt people, hurt other people. 
I respect the boyfriend because clearly he's farther along in his journey of healing than she is because she likes discomfort so much. She likes disruption so much that she was upset her boyfriend wouldn't give her back what she was trying to serve him. Oh, you just going to walk around here peaceful. You just going to be happy in my presence. What's going so good in your life that you don't want to argue with me? What is this Hakuna Matata thing you talking about? Let me tell you what that is, Jenna Lisa. It's called making a choice. And when you are protecting your peace, you have to make the choice to not allow anybody to make you angry. Don't let them disturb your peace of mind or upset you. Don't give your power away to another king or queen. You decide your mood, not them. Jenna Lisa, you tried it. And every other peace disruptor out there, I'm going to pray for you. I want you to get healing. And to all my brothers and sisters out there that are attempting to be the best versions of themselves, living their best lives, protecting their peace, I want to tell you, please, please, please protect your peace today and every day. Rise above any ignorance and don't allow someone else's misery to steal your joy. Please give Jenna Lisa Lawrence the sweet sounds of the Hamiltons. You are the donkey mm. of the day. Ooh, ooh, you are the donkey of the day. All right. Well, thank you for that donkey of the day, Charlemagne. That's right. Donkey of the Day is brought to you by the law office of Michael S. Lamisoff. Don't be a donkey. Dial pound 250 on your cell and say the bull if you've been hurt in a construction accident. That's pound 250 from your cell and say the bull.